comfortable before. David, can you can you talk about some proof points around the applications? I mean, obviously, you know, it's like having RAM and a PC back in the old days, right? So it's, like it's all on, on demand there. What are you seeing from your business and that you're disrupting and some proof points around you know, that's a very those new things? It's an interesting question because it spans such a large spectrum because we're talking about a fundamental new building block, right? So it impacts uh, and will impact every everything in the entire data center. But we can take out some for key examples. Um, in the database world, like we were talking about, it typically means that a, a database server can do about 10 times the throughput for the same server. Um, and those responses, the queries, are answered 30, 40% faster. So it means faster page loads, more throughput per server. So answers.com, uh, retrofitted their MySQL scale-out database tier and saw nine times the throughput per server. What they chose to do was to shrink the database farm uh, four to one. So they got a 75% a consolidation and with that remaining one out of every four servers, they were still getting in total more than twice the throughput they had before. So they re-architected essentially their database platform. Right. And you know, one way to think of what we do is we sell server consolidation just like VMware, but our server, we do that on the data intensive end of the spectrum yeah. where it requires such a large data set or such fast access that it wouldn't all fit in RAM, it wouldn't all fit in spindles. Well, you know, we, we cover uh, a lot of about data on SiliconANGLE and Dave researches with Wikibon. You know, everyone's talking about big data, you know, Hadoop's of the world, and, yep. but yep. there's little data. We've been teasing out this notion of little data. Low latency, fast response times, edge devices, well, like with virtualization, little data becomes big data because you can pack as many workloads as, as you want exactly. to on a system. You, you got fast and it big data at that point because now you've jumbled all the I/O together. So, <laughs> so you're fast big data. That's right. right. So that's right. a good way to think about it. Fast big data, and in combination with VMware, what it allows you to do is to further increase your consolidation ratios because what what limits the number of virtual servers or virtual desktops you can fit on a single machine. Um, is the memory capacity required and the I.O. performance required. This fits both of those bills and allows you to completely remove those as